Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Bridget. The man behind the camera is The Beard. The Beard. And in today's video, we are doing our second episode of Around the World Foods. We are doing baklava, which is a dessert, so it's not technically a main dish. We actually had filmed that, but our camera went stupid and we weren't able to... I still blame the cameraman. ...to upload it. <laughs> Um, we lost that footage and we also lost my grocery haul footage so we are refilming with just the dessert portion but that's okay we're doing what we can so I'm not going to be cooking today the beard is going to be cooking today and I'm going to try to keep his face out of it so we are going to switch angles and here comes the beard So, you need a pound of chopped walnuts. We just chopped these in our food processor. A cup of sugar, some cinnamon, some water, and some phalo dough. You can find this in the freezer section of your grocery store. And you need some melted butter and some honey. And a, and a tray thing. I think it's an 8 by 11. So. Anyway, first thing you do, butter your pan. Sides. And preheat your oven to? 350. And bake it for? 45 minutes. And I will leave the recipe down below in the description box. Thingy, my jigger. Put your pan up. This is a pound of chopped walnuts. Why is it the same stuff? Because I'm bull in a china closet. You really are bull in a china then, closet. There's some measurement for the cinnamon, but I use cinnamon sugar because I like mine a little sweeter. You can just put some in there to your liking. We'll leave the actual recipe down below, guys. And then. Toss your nuts. Until they're good and mixed up. Okay, put those aside. You get your phyllo dough. And unroll it carefully. Because it's, like, it's really thin, guys. It's like paper. It's like paper, yeah. It's okay. super thin. And then you take two or three sheets. I like to take whatever I can grab because I got big stubby fingers. Two or three sheets and you put them down in there. You can trim them if you want, but you don't have to. You take some of your oh butter first. And we just melted this in the microwave. You butter your phyllo. You want to get it covered good but not soaked. nuts. And then just repeat the process? Yeah, you want to two or three layers of each time and then you want to have six or eight Layers total. Right, Study fingers.
go. Now what are you doing? A little bit of cinnamon sugar on top. Not a whole lot. You don't have to do this, I just like the way it makes it look. Okay, next. Hey, Sorry, I, mean I need a sharp, sharp, sharp knife. Look, these are the herbs that the beard is growing me. See? Night, buddy. Hey, you didn't say goodnight. Night. Night. Okay. Okay, next you want. What do you put the uh, the thingy on? Uh, medium. Okay. You gotta cut it before you bake it, otherwise you'll never get cut. So, traditionally, Vaca was cut in the triangle, but I found an easy way to cut it. First, you just go. You want a really sharp knife to do this. Yeah, otherwise it sticks. You gotta be really careful. I know that this is gonna sound weird, but it looks like egg whites. Look at it. You probably can't tell on camera, but to me it looks like egg whites. Like eggs. It's exactly what it reminds me of. This is probably the worst part of making this. Imagine if you had to make the filet dough by hand. Uh -uh. Who would never eat baklava? You guys have never seen a make filet dough? Look it up. All right, guys. Sorry, uh, we had uh, technical difficulties. Okay. Well, this is what it looks like. All cut up. Are you gonna stick it in your preheated oven? Three fifty. Three hundred and fifty degrees. Mm. For how long? Forty-five minutes. Or less, so you kind of around 30. Watch right? it depending on your oven. Now what are we doing? Making the syrup. One cup of water. One cup of sugar. And about a half a cup of honey. Honey got all crystally. Then you take a whisk. It's on medium. And you want to bring this to a boil then turn it down so that you got like a simmer. I'm going to simmer it for 20 minutes until it starts to thicken up a little bit and get a little bit darker. And then you pour it over when it's done? Yep. What was it?
most of that. Mm. Probably a nut. Probably. A nut piece. I get your thing stove all sticky. Be bad. Okay guys, now that it's at a boil, we're gonna lower it down and let it simmer and cook for 20 minutes to thicken up to put on our baklava. It just now started boiling. It just now started boiling. So, okay, look at her go. We will be back and show you from there. So I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, so the sauce is done. Bubbling away. And the baklava is done. The beard's got the apple meat on. We're pulling it out of the oven. It's still we still have like 14 minutes on it, but it's done. I mean you guys can it's see how it's pulled away from the sides yeah, and it's that's how you crispy. Can see? It's pulled away from the sides and it's super pretty and crispy. So we canceled our oven and now we're just gonna pour this on top. And then it's done. Ooh. Now it's just gonna suck up that goodness. Yes. And this let it sit for a little bit before you eat it. is the completed dessert. You can see it bubbling, guys. It looks really good. It smells really good, too. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Hold on, I'm going to turn me around. Beard has the camera now, guys. Okay, so back. I had to take a quick shower because my back was hurting while that was in the oven. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave it a thumbs up. And if you're wondering why my shirt was changed, that's why, because I took a shower. But anyways, I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave it a thumbs up. Don't forget to... The beard's pointing down. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Feel free to share it. Follow me on Instagram. And leave me a comment of what your favorite dessert is. I would really love to know. What, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> you broke it. You, you broke what it. What are you doing? I just took a shower, you <laughs> jerk. <laughs> if you want the beard, he is for sale. No reasonable offer will be refused. And no returns, <laughs> right? Nope, no return to sender. I'm just gonna put him in a box and no return address. <laughs> no return to sender. No reason why for will be refused. <gasps> <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.